<laughs> Holy sh- What up family, it's your boy Amaru back with another review and this time I'm reviewing Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Yes, we have another Spider-Man movie and this time it's animated. But instead of Peter Parker, we are following Miles Morales, a black and Puerto Rican high school kid in Brooklyn who after getting bitten by a radioactive spider, finds out that he's living in one of many dimensions that have many other spider people. Peter Parker, Miles Morales, Spider-Woman Gwen Stacy, Penny Parker, Black Noir Spider-Man, and Spider-Animals, Spider-Ham. This might be the best Spider-Man movie ever. This might be the best Marvel movie ever. Who are wrong? And it was made by Sony, not Marvel Studios. All of you are wrong! This damn well be the best movie of the year. Oh, Let's just start with the visuals. I will never again say that a comic book movie jumps off the page. Because this is a literal interpretation of a comic book come to life. The combination of CG and hand-drawn animation is something we've never seen before. And it makes it have a texture like it's actual paper when the characters are moving. And they choose to blur parts of the screen to make you focus on one thing. And when everything comes back into full view, every color pops, every panel is just animated and energetic, and every onomatopoeia, tap, and pow is just, it mesmerizes you. Then the score matches so much with that energy that everything about this movie connects. The story and pacing will make you go from having a gut-busting laugh to sweat-filled tension to crying like a baby and back to laughing out loud all within the span of five minutes. The characters are ones you want to stay with for decades in sequels or even in a television show. There's there's allusions to the comic books as well as to our own Spider-Man movies that makes it believable and it allows it to be packed with villains and heroes but not feel overpacked. Everything about this movie is just joyful and makes you want to see it again and again. The performances were amazing. Each character was created as if the actors were playing versions of themselves in the Spider-Man universe. Shameik Moore plays Miles, Brian Tyree Henry plays his dad, and Mahershala Ali plays his uncle. From Dope and the Get Down, Atlanta, Widows and If Bill Street Could Talk, Moonlight, Green Book, and Luke Cage Season 1, these three have been on flawless runs and they continue it in this movie. Jake Johnson has played nothing but Nick from New Girl. I will push if I wanna push! In every movie he's been in since that show, and here, we get Peter Parker, played by Nick Miller, played by Jake Johnson, I hate doors! and it still fits perfectly. From Haley Steinfeld to Zoe Kravitz, John Delaney, Kamiko Glenn, every actor chosen was perfectly cast as their character. I mean, who else could pull off a noir Spider-Man more than the genius who gave us no, not the beast. The only fault I can see in this movie is one we see in a lot of these films where our hero all of a sudden can master the skills that he couldn't two minutes ago. But this movie is so self-aware and you're so invested in everything, by the time that comes up, you don't care. Casual moviegoers may see another Spider-Man, especially an animated one, and say, yo, I'm done, I don't need any more. But if you're gonna go see this movie, or if you have seen this movie, please bring somebody with you because this is an amazing piece of art. It is for kids, it is for adults, it is for everybody. It is everything we want in a Spider-Man movie. And I said that about Homecoming. I didn't think it could beat Homecoming, but it did. It is the best Spider-Man we have gotten on screen. With that, I'm giving Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse 9.5 out of 10 spinoffs and sequels of the Spider-Verse that we're already getting starting with the Spider-Woman Gwen Stacy one starring Haley Steinfeld that was announced before this movie even came out in theaters to the public. It's that good, people. It's that good. All right, family, that was my review for Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Let me know in the comment section below how amazing this movie is. If you say otherwise, 
I don't, I don't get you. Like, share, comment, subscribe, share with everybody, share my page, share this movie, and y'all have a happy holidays. Peace.